And it's all like, look at the, the highest points seem to be the reddest. winter jackets on and hiking gear and we're gonna switch it up and do a little hike today that frog is the color of leaves Well, if you had to, be able to curl up in there. <laughs> Much room. That's a crazy. Look at go, that. Go right on it. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> That's a big mushroom. It feels like sponge cake. <laughs> Mossy quartz. That's got a nice ring to it. I don't think this is the lookout, but I think it is a lookout. Look out for that stick going in my eye. Wow, wow, wow. She said her catchphrase. <laughs> Alright, three? No. <laughs> Very red. Very cool. What was I gonna say? It's just an average Saturday. There you go. <laughs> Sandhill trains, I think. That's freaking. Oh, 
And I can see the boat launch from here. It's nice and calm. All right, good thing you remembered that birch tree. Think I could lift this? Yeah. yeah. And we're back in our dry suits. We're back heading on the water. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that must be it. And it's like the only clearing up there, right? Eh? So I don't know if the GoPro can pick it out, but the boldest spot there is where we stood and where we sat, where we had a slow dance. And the cool thing is that cliff runs all the way in. So in the crux, you can follow the river up and you kind of see where, where the cliff's end is where we started. So we went all the way up, cut up, walked our way through, found our way right to there and managed to find our way back comfortably all the way back down comfortably and all the way back to our boats quite a feat a lot more than you think a lot longer than you might think but we managed to do it it's on the strava too and we got about 45 minutes left of light the boat launch is right around the corner there pretty cool trip for a saturday For what it's worth, it is October 1st and it's certainly cold out. It's probably like five degrees Celsius. The water's probably cool. Okay, three, two, one.